Welcome to the PTA Podcast. In this episode, we will talk about PTA Callaghan's newest update, 1.1.200. Now please remember, everything I said is from the official PTA Discord server. Let's get into the episode. Now, for some reason, this update was built entirely developed in secret since November 29th. Finally, they rebuilt and reopened 86th Street. 86th Street was closed since January, I think. Wait, um, probably. I'm not sure. I I don't think 86 was closed in January. I think it was February? I don't know, I forgot. So, they removed the service change posters. Trackage to station, which I probably possibly means that it looked completely brand new and it looks like it's from a new york city subway station that you see probably in times square so the white zone yard has been rebuilt and all trains should now run over with completely no issues so let's say i'm terminating at 74th street catlin broadway and I want to head to the yard so that way, because there's no um, switching cabs. I don't think they will add until 1.2, I think. But oh well. So, for so on the curve to the yard, you have to make your train not in service in order to go to the yard. Just click on turn and then. And then yes, it's it's gonna say two yard, and yeah, it's gonna curve you onto the middle track, but and then curve you to the yard to to the yard track, and then just make a loop. So yes, you don't have you don't you no longer have to worry about switching cabs, but yeah. You don't have to worry about switching cabs. You're welcome. Now, I'm just gonna shut up now. So, 53rd Street was rebuilt with exits. Exits. Finally. Now, once you spawn into 53rd Street, you spawn outside, which is very cool. And there's a store, well, or should I say, uh, cuisine next to the 53rd Street station. And it is called Evie's International Cuisine, I think. Yeah, it's called that. Probably. I guess. So, they made 53rd Street an accessible station. But, the elevators don't work. If it does, let me know. So, Calgary Street looks rebuilt. And if you spawn at Calgary Street, the mezzanine looks the same. The drummer is still the same. But once you go into the platform, it looks a bit familiar. The station, the top, well, the top corners, look like Sufton Boulevard, Archer Avenue, JFK Airport. 
on the E, J, and Z trains. Which looks pretty cool. You can make a parody on Calgary if you're Coke. The R68 has been rebuilt. Also as the R68A. So, the R68A now has a 1980s version. And the R68A has a small chance of spawning a test set. Good luck. So, the R68 door chimes sound different. The opening sound sounds different. But there is one cool feature on the R68. If you see this small pop-up that says door, I forgot what it's I forgot what it's called. Hold E and it just creates a Popeye door. And you could do the same thing on basically every car or two. Nah, it's every car. And I say it's a pretty cool feature. So great, great job, Potato. Great job. Oh, sorry, I accidentally smacked my mic. I also forgot to say that the R68's roll sign placement looks different. Just like the one in real life that you can find in New York. New York City. Now, every through station now has functional countdown clocks. So, Potato and his team, or crew, added new countdown clocks to 74th Street, Catton Broadway, 21st Street, Putnam Square Gardens, Vanderbilt Avenue, Presidential Highway, and Avenue Q. They added Telecity, I think that's how you pronounce it. Countdown clocks to 66th Street, Excalibur, 28th Street, Myrtle Avenue, Jerome Street, Finch Avenue, Georgian Avenue, Dean Street, and 17th Avenue. They added beeping Telecity countdown clocks to 16th Street as well as Finch Avenue's mezzanine. Terminals has received decorative next train signs instead, so that way people don't get confused. They added next train decorative signs at Myrtle Avenue, Mezzanine, and Ridgeworth Island. Um, oh, what's next? Okay, that's a lot. They... Change the sky to be less deary. I think that's how you say it. They made 39th Street accessible. Pillars are at Georgian Avenue have been repainted. Updated route maps on station station signage. They removed un, the unnecessary exit sign at 21st Street Putnam Square Gardens. They fixed the improper placement of two exit signs at 74th Street, Catlin Broadway, and removed two unnecessary sign texts. They fixed no exit sign clipping into light at 74th Street, Catlin Broadway, Catlin Broadway. (coughs) They added the missing countdown clock and bypass sensors. At 74th Street, Catlin Broadway, and 66th Street, Excalibur, they removed the Aronis boarding area signs at 28th Street. They moved the Rarts around 
they set two rarts on fire, told the Van Dyne Avenue rart band to play a little quieter. Still, it's still jamming into this day. They adjusted the stop markers at Finch. Construction site near Ridgeworth Island Yard has finished work. They made the junction north of Presidential Highway suck less. A new park started construction near 17th Avenue. A new park appeared near 86th Street. There's various other scenery tweaks. Doomsday Diner has reopened, reopened at 86th Street. A Hardy Mart, a Hardy Mart, is open for business at 86th Street. New, I, I, I should say that more better. New construction site at 86. Wonder what they're working on. 21st Street scenery has been updated. Several Evie's International Cuisine restaurants has opened, which I mentioned at 53rd. Updated normal maps and diagram maps. And for some reason, they removed Herobrine. I I have no idea why was he added into the game. So, yeah. I guess that's all I have to say for this episode. Thank you for listening to this podcast. And if Potato's listening to this, Potato, this podcast is for the PTA community. Just remember that. Thank you for listening, and I'll see you in episode two, which might be a really short episode, is the Fifth Avenue update. 1.3.228, which is going to be a very short episode. So be prepared for that. Thanks for watching. And please subscribe to King Chorks Gaming, the YouTube channel. And make sure to listen to PTA Stories. I don't. I. It's already a work in progress. And yeah. That's all I have to say. Goodbye, my PTA passengers. I'll see you tomorrow.